Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode here on Pastiche of Skin. Today we are playing Kitty Powers Matchmaker. Yeah. Yeah, this game exists. Um, essentially a dating sim kind of mobile app game. I, I've seen the trailers for this. The trailers are wonderfully cheesy. Oh, yeah. If, they, if you've actually caught one of these yourself. Yep. Um, but the game doesn't. Like, it feels like um, Honey Can Studio or uh, Honey Pop. It feels like one of those games that's intentionally kind of like double entendre heavy, but really shows nothing. Um, but we'll see what <laughs> Kitty I, Powers has just, got to show. Just going by the trailer I'd seen, I I would have like I don't know who I don't know who Kitty Power is. I have no clue who this uh, person is. Mm -hmm. But I feel if it had been. The, the double entendres and the cheesy, cheesy lines coming out. I think somebody like Alan Carr would have been better for this. Well, I mean, it's part and parcel of like the. the God stage. damn it, Unity! <laughs> Unity, <laughs> Unity is used for everything, man. We got it's just it's, it's got a multitudinal space to actually work in, man. But um, yeah, I I think it's like it's part and parcel of like a, a drag style, a stage drag comedy act as part mm. of like a, a a club show, and um, it works really well with the. The, the 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 vicinity of obscenity. So there are ten types of people in this town. Some have things. Oh, I was reading. You know, I was rude. I'm your new boss. Okay. The mission is to expand this sad little branch of my dating agency to its full potential. Oh well, thank you very much for the responsibility. <laughs> Finding love with as many clients as possible. Well, are we taking up the challenge? Can I just not have sex with him instead? Yeah, you music? just have, se have sex with all the clients? My god, man, where where is your professionalism? Oh, only the ones that are interested in me. I mean, oh, of course, yeah, I mean... going guy. Essentially, I make them happy, you know? Exactly. We need to take down your particulars. So what are our particulars? Ah, right. Oh, wait, we had to get to create the char character. Okie dokie. <laughs> right, what do we call on ourselves? Uh, Deuce Bigelow... <laughs> like, what do you think? First name, last name? Uh, what do you call that uh, game from years ago? It was on the PC. La Leisure Shoot Larry. Larry! Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly right. Because it seems the kind of thing that Larry, Leisure Shoot Larry would do. What was yes. but Can you remember Leisure Shoot Larry's actually had a full name? Did he actually have a first last name? Uh, I think he did. He, kind of, he does, when you think about it now, he does, when you said Boost Eglow, Male Jiglo, he does remind me of now of Rob Schneider. Rob Schneider is Leisure Shoot Larry. I feel like that's gonna be the next film. Oh, that would actually that would actually work. If they actually made, <laughs> if they made a live action version of Leisure Suit Larry, Rob Schneider could really rock the shit out of that role. Yeah, it would be the one. It would be a role that'd save his uh, career because apparently he was coming out with. Is he coming out with like racist or anti-Semitic things or something about 9/11? Oh, really? Yeah, someone had, someone had just nosedived his career. Wow. Uh, Jimmy got the controls there to actually turn this down because it's a little bit loud. Oh, hang on. No, no. Bring the fourth wall here. Bring the fourth walls, yep. all of the walls. Uh, just because the actual like soundtrack to this game is a little bit loud. Um, I think they may have had an issue with audio balancing, mm. <laughs> as is, as I always tend oh, to. Oh yes. Uh, so how do you spell Schneider? <laughs> okay, no, 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 that I have to Google. That I have to like check for it. See if you're getting it right or wrong. Comment below if you believe our spelling is atrocious. And oh, it's limited the amount of letters you can put in the last name too. What if I? What if you wanted to put it along? What if? We, what if it was? If I tried to use my actual last name, it would actually not fit. What if it was like Chil Chilander Blong Bong? Bong? <laughs> like if Bong would actually only be four yeah. letters, it'd be absolutely fine. What What name is on uh, Chandler Bing's um, TV guide? Chilander Bong, something Chandler like that. Bong. Well, fair play to him. Um, we're we're going to be La Larry Schneider. 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 Rob Schneider. Rob Schneider is. Um, let's see. S C H N E I D. ER. Yeah. Well, like, I mean, that's the only thing I'm missing is it's the end. end. Yeah, and I tried, to put, put it I tried to put the head in, so it won't fit. God damn. All right, so uh, what kind of person are we? I think we're a Pisces. You tried to put it in, but it wouldn't fit. Yes. What? Think... That's what she <laughs> hey! said. Hey! We started the double intelligence now. Oh, put a counter yeah. in the corner, lads. <laughs> Find it down. <laughs> Ding! All right, so um, I think we'd be a Pisces. So, Very, um, like, we'd definitely be a water sign. I'm not going to make a comment about being wet around you, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, we're on the cusp of being horns, horny, and we, we be are in February for a start. So Valentine's is coming up, so we should keep it for like, since you like put yeah. in Valentine's. What what is Valentine's? 
Jungle Dice but... apparently is a watering can. It's, a, it's Aquarius. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I want to be on the cusp of uh, Pisces and Aries so we can be really, we can be property horny and be wet at the same time. I think it works. What's your legit star sign? Uh, I probably am Aries. I don't even fucking know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's Aries. But doesn't, uh, that, doesn't it change matter on the year of your birth as well? Which do you find most 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 attractive? Men, women, both. Both! What do you find more attractive? So this isn't actually about you running the store. You really do want to have sex with all the people in the game as well, then? Yep, because, well, she, like she says, give her all the gossip. All right, so black hair, blue hair, green hair, purple hair, dusty Kit, Kitty pink wants hair. all the gossip. Kitty got... <laughs> yes, yeah, they, they did go to the bother of putting in ginger as well as red. They played wait, 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 they put in two? Yeah, ginger and red. <laughs> I but it's, it's legit red. It's a red red. Yeah, yeah. Not ginger and then blonde. And they uh, light brown. So the only thing they're missing is the ginger blonde or the strawberry, strawberry blonde. Strawberry blonde. You need to actually put a strawberry blonde in there. So uh, we're going to be blue oh, hair. What, what you want to hear is strawberry lime St magners. <laughs> strawberry and lime magners. Just pour that over your head. Is that going to do the coloring? Blue eyes, blue hair. Yeah. We like a color scheme working our way down. I'm glad it wasn't blonde. I could accuse you of being, you know, a fan of the Aryan race. <laughs> uh, <laughs> fantastic. Uh, edgy types love dark and alternative culture. They mostly come out at night. Mostly. Mostly. Mostly come, mostly come out at night. night. Mostly. Wow, there's a lot of alien references going on. Yeah, well, I mean, after the last couple of videos, we had John Hurd reference in the last one. But, um, yeah, the Newt, wasn't it? Mostly come out at night. Yeah, Mostly. Newt. Um, vintage, hippie, chick, arty, hipster, geeky, glam, sporty. Practical. Hang on, wait. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Shh. How indeed. So, uh, what do you think? Well, hipsters will go fuck themselves for a start, so anything else is fine by me. <laughs> anything but hipster. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go geeky. Let's, right. let's, let's play the type. But, uh, yeah. Do you like to look? Oh, there you go. I think it actually works perfectly fine. There's our blue eyes, blue hair. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. What would you like to look like? Did yeah. I just select that in the previous menu? Yeah, but essentially, it like, narrows it down, and then you could go like, well, maybe that's not what I want to look like all the time. Yeah, no, fair enough, fair enough. But there we go. Now's the time to probe your innermost depth of your personality. Oh, this has actually got a full-on personality quiz. Are we going to be turned into, like, Scientologists because of this? <laughs> when it comes to work, do you prefer a physical job or an office job? I'm just going to put this out here. If... Watching Tom Cruise films doesn't make you a Scientologist. I don't think this. I don't think this personality test is going to do it. No, it's actually not the Tom <laughs> Cruise films. It's the, um... Oh, uh, what do you call him? Travolta. He did Battlefield Earth. That's an actual Scientologist film. Okay, we definitely doing a rip track of that. I've never watched You've never seen Battlefield Earth? Nope. Oh, man, that's fucking genius. Does it look shit? It's, uh, <laughs> is a Forrest Whitaker in that as well? Yeah, damn, man. Like they, they, he, he did sci-fi before it was cool. You know, like... Oh, he, God, no, 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 no. Before no. Sci-fi was definitely cool, cool before Battlefield Earth. Um, God. Oh, God. There's so much to show you. Let me show uh, you office, a office world. Job. All right, there, Disney. <laughs> uh, when it comes to work, do you prefer a physical job or an office job? Well, I have an office, because all you do is sit and edit, and all I do is, I don't know, wank yeah, on a laptop. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> you wank on a laptop or work on a laptop? I said wank, but yeah, I, you uh, did. I was going to say I, 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 said, I didn't know. I didn't know whether to call you on it or. You could have said wank near a laptop because. Oh yeah, yeah, I mean you don't. I mean you don't want to have to wipe it down afterwards. You get streaks on the glass or the plat on the screen. You don't have to buy a new laptop every time. Yeah, uh, well, it's it matters whether or not you let it dry in. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you watch an awesome movie about street dance. Do you take a street dance lesson or buy it on DVD? Uh, we had to. Be buy a DVD because then I could smash it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you have to dig a big hole. Would you rather get a spade and start digging or pay someone else to do it? I would dig it myself. Yeah, same here. Every hole's a goal. <laughs> Getting diggy diggy <laughs> hole. Get, get diggy with it. Na 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 na. Do you right. like Will Smith references? Fair enough. Uh, well, I don't mind Will Smith. I just don't like references to him. When it comes to friends, do you like to organize group activities or let someone else organize? Uh, a bit of both. You have to pick. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. That's why I'm letting <laughs> you pick it. All right. Uh, organize group activities. Uh, I like to organize them. <laughs> when cleaning the house, do you clean thoroughly or just do the obvious bits? The obvious bits. Thoroughly. <laughs> yeah, I know for a fact that's bullshit. Yeah, I know. That's why I chose it. Because <laughs> you know why? <laughs> no way. Guys, 
In the way that's bullshit. Don't uh, move the camera! <laughs> oh no, I'm not moving the camera. <laughs> Like, ding! Double entendre cam yes. the corner. There we go, got another one. <laughs> uh, when you go out for the evening, do you go home at a certain time or play it by ear? Um, play it by ear. Yeah, play it by ear. I mean, I'm going to get, I'm going to get the last bus. I'll make sure I'll get the last. I'll get, I'll get the last train. It, is there tomorrow. some taxis running? <laughs> tomorrow, I get the last bus tomorrow. Uh, I can wake up tomorrow here and I'll be fine. When out with a partner, would you keep hands off in public or make public displays of affection? Are you a big fan of PDAs? <laughs> no, they are. Aren't, isn't that technology I did it? Yeah, I mean, essentially, like, it killed it well, along with the, um... Beeper? Beeper and everything else that goes <laughs> along with it. Like, I mean, P PDAs, Palm Pilots, and, uh, Blackberries? Blackberries, yeah. yeah. I was thinking that. Sidekicks as well. Wasn't the sidekicks were the ones for texting? We didn't really have sidekicks over here. They're more of a states thing. Somebody tweet me that. I don't want to even want to Google that. What a sidekick was? Yeah. Do you, do you remember the old phones that actually had full keyboards on them? Oh, texting? yeah. Oh my god, yes. There you go. Because there's a meme forever. It's been going around for for the last couple of years where Kelly Rowland is pissed off at, like, I don't know, her boyfriend in the video. And she the phone is slid. She's got it in her hands and it's slid up. And you can see that she's doing, like, um, she's, like she's trying to text him on a fucking Excel spreadsheet. All right. Uh, the meme it's is. Actually like, it's actually, like, setting up in the room. It's like, you know. She's pissed off at boyfriend, yet she's trying to text him using <laughs> she, Oh, no, but you open the spreadsheet and you're sitting there going like, well, I'm so angry and I'm going to rebalance this budget. Weird. On an evening night, do you prefer a quiet pub or a packed nightclub? A oh, pub. Pub. Go to the pub. Quiet pub. <laughs> All we need is pubes. Uh, when watching TV, do you prefer watch alone or watch with friends? Alone. I mean, I prefer to do it with friends, but sometimes I'd like to watch TV alone because, well... Yes, yeah, you actually get to enjoy the show. Yeah, they can yeah. fuck up. <laughs> I mean, a lot of people actually don't like. A lot of people watch shows and do like, why are they doing that? I was like, what? if you fucking watch for another minute or Who's two, you'll find out. Who's that guy? I'm watching the same film as you. You'd be <laughs> quiet. I would. I, I would, would know. I, if I haven't seen this before, I'm assuming you do believe that I'm actually like, I'm prescient. I know what's going to happen next. <laughs> when it comes to washing up, would you rather do it in the sink or stick it in the dishwasher? I always want to stick it in the dishwasher. I don't know. It's just, um, it, the, the vibrations. I prefer to stick it in the sink and swish it around a bit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> swish it around the sink. It's like scrub, yep. scrub, scrub, and then rinse. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's a good. Apparently, it is the easiest way to get rid of uh, glitter if you actually happen to have nether regions of it in any way, shape, or form. Let's do it in the sink. When doing your finances, would you rather go to the bank in person or do internet banking? Um, usually, I mean, it depends what it is, but usually, I go to the bank. Especially if, it's, especially, especially if it's making a heavy deposit. You know, <laughs> deep, heavy deposits. What's that? Yep. Uh, yep. There's ding. no one in the there corner. Go. Uh, no there one. Go. Ding, ding. goes up again there. You need to tell a friend something quickly. Do you call them on the phone or send them an instant message online? Uh, ooh, no, definitely. Fuck. Don't call them. Fuck that. Yeah, nobody no calls way. anybody anymore. So if you call somebody, they assume that you're actually prank calling them. <laughs> it's going out for the evening. Would you rather go to a poetry reading or a show? Burlesque. Of course, the burlesque show. An attractive server in the coffee shop winks at you. Do you blush and run away or spend all your money on coffee? Blush. Yeah, because I don't want to spend my money on coffee. And coffee sucks. Uh, no, I do love coffee. I just don't want to spend it on this fucking Starbucks because somebody winked at me. It sucks. When buying a bed, do you consider how well you will sleep or how strong the bread springs are? Bouncy, bouncy. All is fair and loving. Bouncy, bouncy. Mm. I have broken beds before. You consider the bouncy, bouncy. Fair enough, fair enough. Bouncy, bouncy. After all that... After all that, this had better be correct. Are you sure? Are we a Pisces March 1st with the name Larry Sheeter that it's a woman who's relaxed, methodical, introverted, traditional, and spicy and likes guys, girls, blue <laughs> eyes, and blue hair and has blue hair herself? That, that is correct. Did you feel that that time? I have no idea what that was. I thought it was actually on the Richter scale. <laughs> so, details on the ID card. So, remember the names. Average. Well, I mean, you have to start average before you get theirs. Fair enough. You need me. I'm just at the other end of the kitty phone. The kitty phone. I'll even give you some coins to get you started. Because I'm generous like that. Oh, that's such a generous soul. I will be sent anonymously to that's other... Fucking depressing. <laughs> oh, so you actually, like, you go to other people as a secret shopper to kind of judge them? 
When that's sent out, that mean it's been sent out to your friends list? Yeah. <laughs> Send your avatar on a date. Is this a legit? No, it's not a legit dating game. What do you mean, an actual like dating sim where you actually go dating? <laughs> or yep. this is this is a mobile app that happens to have dating elements? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god. Oh, sorry, it's not in my profile. <laughs> <laughs> it's not my it's not not my personality either. Check your letterbox for feedback. Always check your box for feedback. Always check your box for something. <laughs> and if you're not sure, go visit your doctor. Should we advertise first? Where should we advertise? In Club Edgy, Club Glam, or Club Geeky? Well, obviously Geeky. I mean, fucking yep. nerds. Nerds! Those geeky types look pretty lonely to me. Aww. As we do. Okay, let's get you started with your first client. Select the play button. <laughs> the music was almost exactly well timed for that one moment. <laughs> Fair play. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. And then we'll start into the tune again. Don't like him. Looking. Mustache looks weird. Client, and then take them to the hot seat. Mm. Wait, is, this, is that virtual body shaming? Yeah. Ah oh, balls. Yeah, that's uh, you. You to be honest, you're body shaming a mustache, really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a dungeon master, and I'm looking for a woman. Hi. <laughs> All right. What I'm Ludwig. I'm an onion master and I'm looking for a woman. He's Scottish? Yeah. Uh, I was actually going almost scouse. Oh, really? Uh, you said like uh, Trey Parker's character <laughs> out of Biscopal. What does this look like? An execution? Oh, I love you. Always have, always will. Always will. Ah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Can I do it, Captain? I've, I've completely lost the voice I had in my head there because I've actually gone like two Because I went <laughs> scouse and then I lit his beard and then I did the Trey Parker one and then I'm gone and I'm like. I have no idea what the fuck that guy's voice was, so I'm just going to make up a new one. We'll just, you know, read what's there and see what comes up. Yeah. I'm interested in comic books, tabletop war wow, games, and inventing wa wank wacky machines. <laughs> and I love blue eyes and light brown hair. You are. Can you find yeah. me with a perfect match? <laughs> right there. Oh, yeah, I no, don't like him. Don't like him. I'm not him. Don't like him. But just this once, I'll show you the best one. Scrooge with particulars. And their peculiars. Limo driver, database, uh, or database administrator, car wash attendant, lorry driver, toilet attendant, and train driver. So, train driver can drive a train through your tunnel. Toilet attendant can get you to the glory hole. Uh, the lorry driver can probably dump your dead body. And the car wash attendant can get you all soaping wet. Well, which one do you think you would like the best? <laughs> Probably the toilet attendant. I mean, what, me? Oh, me? My, oh, Larry. Larry would, uh... Wait, no, this guy? L L no, wait. L L Finkleforth L is Einhorn. Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkleforth. Finkleforth, not the name, but uh, I can't remember the actual name. Finkle, uh, Finkle is Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkle. Yes, yes, yes. This is a hot seat where you compare your client's profile with their potential candidates. The one I pointed out is clearly the best match. Ch the date button. Dating. One wait, 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 wait. Christina Bangbert. Sorry. Barnberg. Barn Barnberg. I think it's a bang barn. Lorry driver. Some sort of porn title. Well, we're going with her. Morgan. Hmm. Take Talia Masterwell. Who the hell's Talia Masterwell? The car wash done? How did we know that she was the best? How is that the best? What the fuck? Okay. I think it's by it's being forced for the actual test of this. You want to send them to to impress their date. Oh, um, Jamaican, because, uh, no, is it Jamaican? Because they're going to be Jamaican love tonight. And don't take someone to the same place twice. Eating Vopa, all right. So get ready to watch the envelopes. It's going to mix them up and then mix pick one. Oh, God. All right. What? All right. For where? All right. For Jamaica, I think. No, it's the middle one for Jamaica. <laughs> and she's telling us to pick this one. What the fuck? Don't tell us to pick that one. Pick, pick whatever. Oh, cheeky. I'm trying to help you here. 
What's the point of playing the game if the game's going to tell you how to... The, how, what tutorial, the... tutorial, tutorial, tutorial. Oh, yeah, shit. Yes. Tutorial, tutorial, tutorial. The king's helmet? Really? Ha! Ah! If you rub his helmet, you might actually get a knighthood. Oh, quit. <laughs> and I'm done. And I'm done. Making birds suddenly appear. Every time you are near. Oh, come on. King's helmet? I know that's a sword, but... Cameras I've had installed. Secret cameras? It's a guy... Oh, it's just a fire. Eh, fair enough. I a pervert? I don't know. CCTV. See, we're going to control both of them via earpieces, so I'm actually sending you just like puppets bang together. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh. Tim Let America. me wear my lucky pants. Like Team America just. Oh, hello. Are you Talia? <laughs> you have to do Talia. Oh. Yes, I am. You must be Ludwig. Why? I just be nice, all the way around. Nice to meet you. A match made in a pound shop. <laughs> <laughs> that was a nice place, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it ain't bad for a bit of nosh. <laughs> I want you to mash on me. I mean, I love your blue eyes. Ah, cheers. That's a nice thing to say, isn't it? <laughs> it has a nice, like, brown color, isn't it? Thanks, I just had it done. My carpet matches the drip. <laughs> Good evening. What I, you like to order now? <laughs> yeah, nice one. <laughs> I love the fact that's actually like I'm getting the voice reasonably right. Oh, you fancy then? I like some. <laughs> I like something hot with no meat. Like some pussy. I'm a vegetarian, so you can never eat meat. <laughs> also, I'm trying to avoid wheat. And words that rhyme. They said, because now you have to pick something they like. All right, now. The dishes, you can tip the waiter and ask them by selecting the question mark. Uh, the, wait the waitress. Show you the correct option. Don't say never did anything for you. Yeah, so essentially we're tutorialing, we're tutorial, we're tutorial, 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 tutorial. tutorial, tutorial. Uh, uh, two lots of cauliflower cheese, please. An inspired choice. Sounds delicious. Oh, uh, I'm so like that. <clears throat> yeah, I'm starving and all. Cross your starving, you skinny looking bitch. Alright, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> you probably never calm down. Calm down. Or calm down. I uh, calm down. <laughs> Pick a conversation topic, you think? Red hair, bearded, beard, what the hell? I don't even, what is this? Nudge buttons. But be careful not to repeat yourself, or they won't be impressed. Do, can you do facial decor, hairstyle? Do you want to talk about your, uh, shitty moustache? Shitty moustache or hairstyle? Shitty moustache. Shitty moustache it is! So what are you thinking of me, small moustache? <laughs> Works great. It's so you. Ah, oh, ta love. Ta very much. You like my clean, clear complexion, then? Yeah. Well, ass, you look well tasty, eh? I love. Thanks, I feel fantastic now. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> and later that, that evening. Let's pull the love handle once again and see what we get. Uh, I think he's going to. Facial hair! Oh. Facial hair! Oh. And facial hair! Let's talk about hairstyles. Can you, I like, like, you like my moustache? you like my hair? Uh -huh. you like my hairstyle then? Mm. Looks great. Really suits you. <laughs> oh, shucks. Mm. What do you think of my hair then? Yeah, it's lolly, isn't it? Mm. Oh, I feel like a million dollars, but it only cost me like five or... <laughs> Excuse me, would you like this uh, for a dessert trolley or stop looking each other? <laughs> I should, but this, but just this once won't hurt. Or twice if I like it. So once more, while well, I bring out the trolley. Well, I mean, I hope they ain't too fattening. <laughs> I, I've got a problem that goes straight to me hips. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, here they come! I love them, but pay close attention to the order they're in. Okay. Oh, bald. Them, as their date will be too busy salivating to remember their names. <sighs> On the conveyor belt. Tea ice cream, banana split, fruit salad, tea ice cream, banana split. <coughs> all hand me and delicious. Oh, that fruit dessert looks really nice. Yeah, it does it all. Oh. Well, I mean, which one was it? Uh, of course, tutorial times. Tea banana, ice, split. banana split. 
Duh. Have a banana split if you don't mind. Hopefully they have good taste. Delicious, I'm looking forward to digging into that big, huge banana split. If you give us a lick, love. I knew you'd, uh, you'd want that one, didn't I? She knows she wants the banana. Good for the potassium levels. Time to pull the love handle once again. What adventure shall we find next? I'm gonna snag an STD. Oh, well, I finally horoscope. We'll talk about the horoscope because, good God. You have to do something different. Fucking right. How do you think a horoscope's in? Oh. Not a good nonsense. Uh. I think they're a waste of flipping time. Oh. Yes, astronomy is just such pill. And boulder statue in it. Hmm. Can we get the bill? Or I'll what? get the keys to my apartment, love. Uh. Hey, hang on, I'll just get the white waiter. Uh. Uh, what does oh, that waiter look no, uh, like? Gray hair. Vanessa. Very nervous looking Vanessa. Wow. They all look very, very nervous. They all look. I don't want to be anywhere near you. I don't want you to call my name. Oh my god, I don't know what I did. Oh. <coughs> Vanessa. Hi, oh, thanks for the bit of love. Cheers, nice one. <laughs> well spotted. I <laughs> forgot what they look like. Oh, cheers. They? I remember them anyway. Oh, what's that? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, oh well, yeah, I know. It's, it's just a, a you want Vanessa, to do you? Actually, girls will have the same hair color hair as me. I think I want. Oh, I think they want to clear the table. So I, I suppose it's on time it. we go then. Any? Uh -huh. Let's go our separate ways. <laughs> scary looking cat in the background. Oh, I think I have really old stuff. <laughs> Depending on how much your client likes their date. <clears throat> Can I see you again? Will you go out with me? Will you wear me face off, love? It's on our first date. I still don't. Let's see. Will no. you get out with me, love? Go on. Do you want to get more serious? <laughs> Ooh. Yes, I think I'm in love with you. Aww, tell her, love. Although I might yeah, have... we're in love, ain't we? Although I might have brain damage. Uh. In the hot tub. On the bed. Everywhere. We fucking do it. Touch your grip, pubby dick. <laughs> All right, so this got weird. This got so unbelievably weird. <laughs> do we play on or do we just call it a day at this? Because I mean, this was this was just tutorial, and I could see the actual gameplay being um, a little bit more freestyle, where you actually don't get led don't through every single one of them. Pick this yeah, but time. and you have to actually like essentially pay attention yourself. But it doesn't seem to be that difficult. And I imagine that there'll be more and more details as people's relationships get more interesting. Mm. So, um, yeah. This, this could is, be for life. This, this could be. <laughs> I do why she's like Norwegian. I just, he just chose that whenever we're going through. I was just like, whenever I went scouse, I was going like, yeah, it actually works. <laughs> <laughs> Every single fucking thing he says, it works perfectly. Wait, I might pop the question, I. <laughs> All right. I'm cheating so on you. <laughs> we would have done 3D grabs, but they said I'd use up too many polygons. Oh. Self depreciating humor. Well, oh, she has curves and all like ray pistols, like. So, yeah, this is. Um, I can imagine after maybe an hour, this could, would get super repetitive. Oh, yeah, I can see it being very, very repetitive, but I think the point of the elements is actually having your friends list and having stuff like this happen where you go to other people's pages and other people see your character pop up. And they, they it, it's kind of one of those games that it, it makes you come back because there'll be a reward for coming back each day. Like the game you play. Yeah, the like, kind of like ad, ad, Adventure Capitalist where there you, you go. You, you, it becomes part of your routine where you don't play it for long, but you play it all the time. And then you use the currency to build up and make it easier and more money for yourself and more easier and more money for yourself. And I don't dislike this game in any way, shape, or form. I mean, there's no, there's no games like this on any of the traditional consoles. No. I mean, I'm, I was a big fan of dating some games back in the day for the... Um, PC, uh, they, all those like uh, Japanese ones that came out, like True Love and whatever else. Most of them are all erogue games, all fucking like, essentially. You know, they, they, the borderline between actually being a storyline and a game and actually just being flat out porn was so, <laughs> so narrow. So frightening and narrow. Waiting for that. Yeah, because I mean, like the thing is, a lot of them were censored for over here, so they actually didn't have porn in them. They were they were European censored, 
But if you got the Japanese ones where you patched them, you put it back into the game again. I mean, there was just there were scenes. There was actually like a couple of elements in it. But the oh, rest wait. of it was actually meant to be a dating game. I think we're, you're, you're getting a bit off point there. No, no, I'm not. It's actually like the, this is this is one one of those games with all that content taken out of it. It's just a purely mechanical dating mechanics game where you have to actually pay attention to what people say. It's like it, it, it's uh, on its on its most simple sense. It's kind of like the interrogation tactics in uh, L.A. Noir. Oh. You have to pay attention to the way what people say, pick out the important word, and then apply it. Like this is actually a very super simplified version of that. Or like Papers Please, where you have to go through the game and look at people's uh, immigration papers to let them through the border control. They, these these are all games that actually like work on the same mechanic. It's just this one is taking the love and romance angle rather than actually doing something else that was actually either uh, survival or for investigation purposes. This I'm isn't taking all the romance out of it. <laughs> I'm taking the romance out of this game, but uh, mechanically, there's nothing wrong with this game, and I could see enjoyment in it. And it's cheesy enough that it actually like it would be fun. I could actually like sitting making up characters' voices for all of these because none of them actually speak. <laughs> could be fun. I mean, like uh, I, the fact that I, I got that one on the first go. That might be the your. Uh, that might be where you take this. You just voice voice just everybody. Voice with these characters. <laughs> and since you like continue the relationships further on field, like let them meet up again, see if they actually do get together. You know, like. It's, you already have the animation of the characters there. You can just actually just mouth in any scenes and just have more scenes with them talking anytime you felt like it. I, just, I have an idea. I was kind of worried about why Vanessa and the, all her two witnesses were so nervous. Well, it's because you they know. knew. Do you know why? Because they know about the secret cameras. No. Oh. Ah, 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 see? They knew, they, they knew some like, uh, weird shit was going on, especially whenever they're actually being summoned and brought around. Like, I, It's also like you don't want your restaurant being filled with... Um, Video cameras at any time because you know, you know, at some point you're going to have messed up as a yep. server. Or, so, you know, yeah. hand out a cockroach on a plate. Yeah, exactly. Hello, kittens. You're doing her voice now? No, I'm just like <laughs> uh, first line of it. But yeah, they're essentially talking about the people who made this game. Magic Notion have made really, really simple, small games before now. I think they've actually just made um, kind of like um, many mobile games that were actually like a single element repeated over and over again. This seems to be. Uh, they're making a couple of games like this for... What's wrong? Oh, no, I just I just, I just was just looking at it, and then I realized, oh, shit, there's a lot of text above my head. <laughs> a lot of text right over your head. Yeah. Um, they're actually, they've got another game with Kitty Powers coming out. This isn't this isn't the only Kitty Powers game to be released this year. Oh, God. I look so, forward to reviewing it and the many voices <laughs> we're going to do for that. I, I can see it happening. Um, I'm, I'm not I, I'm not annoyed at this game by any stretch of imagination. It's actually just been fairly entertaining. To be fair, I, I'll, I'll give it its dues. Like, it it plays better than what uh, the trailer let me... I, 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 the, the trailer, I, it just bored the shit. It just, I just bored the shit that annoyed me more than anything else. Yeah, it felt like a really bad kind of like spoof ad from the fast show or something like that. You know, kind of like... It, it's a, it seemed to be like just trending on its comedy value rather than actually being of any any way value, fun to play. Mm. But that actually like this isn't annoying. It's just a lot of like button pressing. Those kind of games where actually button pressing and waiting for the ding, in a lot of cases with a little bit of gameplay. There's no skill based in this. It is just going to eat your time. But if you've got time to waste, this on mobile I'm sure would be entertaining. On console, I don't dare to play on mobile. What? Especially a tablet. It'd be easier to play on the tablet. Oh, yeah, then. it's designed for that. I mean, even looking at the size of the buttons and everything, it's just like it's got that little icon inside. But um, the application of the menu buttons and everything in this is slightly better than some of the other games we've played lately. Yeah. Uh, kind of like the one that I'm referring to. The sliding puzzle, motherfucker. No, no, no. Let's just ignore it, slide and go. <laughs> I'm not going to. I'm going to lose my shit again over that. But yeah, that's. Um, this has been Kitty Powers. Uh, Sim. More Powers there. Yeah, more power stir, fair play. Um, yeah, that was actually that, that, that was actually that was an enjoyable game. And uh, if you if you were I curious, I the voiceover more than anything else. Yeah, same here. But if you were happened to be, um, if you were going to watch uh, or play through any games that were like dating sims of this similar style, there is uh, games on the DS called Love Plus that kind of like are less about getting other people together, but actually you kind of getting together with a character. It's been a huge game series in Japan. I don't know if there's any fan translations at all because it's got an insane amount of text. But um, they, this is like the level where some people have actually married, legally married, DSs because they've fallen in love with their wife through kind of stuff. But um, there's True Love on PC that I remember from years, years back. I'm sure there's plenty of other dating sims that are actually in that vein where you're actually kind of like, it's for yourself. This isn't for you. The whole point is that you're actually getting other people together. So if you enjoy and get like a bit of a ch cheeky laugh out of Blind Date, then you'd probably get an enjoyment out of this. Mine, your DS. Mario, you're dead. <laughs>
Fucking and you can't just no. Don't judge no. other people for their loneliness. People get lonely, man. They need the, they need the recovery. They need they need the feelings of other people nearby, even if it actually is just the warmth of a battery compartment. If I had the chat, if I had the Google, <laughs> I'm pretty sure a sex doll would be cheaper than a Nintendo DS, and uh, would give you less chance of electric shock. <laughs> hey, you're only buying the low quality sex dolls. <laughs> um. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. This has been Kitty Power's Matchmaker. It's been fun. Uh, if you enjoyed this game, make sure to comment underneath and share it around. Uh, if you want to see more of the the voice acting, I want to get a, I, I want a, a Kitty Powers. I want I want a, like uh, you know, give us a retweet. That'd be deadly. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you enjoyed our, our impression making of the game, make sure to give us a shout. Uh, we look forward to seeing further titles from you on the PS4, and I might actually come back to play this again for a little bit more entertainment. And if you guys enjoyed the show, of course, you can always remember to hit the subscribe button right up here. That allows to be able to see every video as it comes out here on the channel and the ones sitting around over the top of will's head he's uh, hiding away from them now are all the videos that we've done on the channel lately and you should check those out as well so remember to like comment subscribe and share and we will see all you dudes in the next video bye